Today we're going to walk you through upgrading PBX in a flash from free PBX 2.8 to free PBX 2.9. So using a web browser, go to the PBX in a flash GUI, click on the user's icon, and then click on free PBX administration. Enter your username and password. and you'll get the free PBBX main GUI. Go to the module admin tab. Check for updates online. And download and install the 2.9 upgrade tool. Once it's installed, you'll see it in the left-hand column, 2.9 Upgrade Tool. Click on that, read the warnings, and click Upgrade Now. Now the trick here is you only want to upgrade the framework module to start with. So go back to Module Admin, uh, check for updates online, and then download and upgrade. Once you get the framework module uploaded, pick the repositories you want to use, check online, upgrade all, and process. Then you're going to want to repeat the steps one more time. Check online, upgrade all, and process. Click the confirm button to proceed. Once you get all the modules loaded, click the return option. And then check one more time online just to be sure you didn't miss anything. Looks like we're clean. So click Apply Configuration Changes and continue with Reload. And then click on the Status option. You'll notice we've gotten a few minor glitches. To get rid of these, you'll need to log into your Linux server with your root password. Once you're logged in, just type amportal chown and it'll clear the uh, amportal conf not writable error. So now if we switch back, clear the error, and reload the status, you'll see that the error is gone. To clear the default asterisk manager password error, uh, you'll need to again be in the Linux CLI and edit the following file. Uh, you can find out how to do this yourself on the PBX in a Flash forum uh, and the forum thread number is 10125. Once you've made the necessary changes, control X and Y to save your changes. Clear the error and restart the status. You load your email address uh, in the general settings at the bottom of the screen. Now you're all set with Asterisk 2.9 and uh, you're ready to move on to Asterisk 2.10 if you'd like. Have a good one.